Well, this is one of those videos that I don't like to admit um, of a uh, mistake, but I did. And um, as you'll see, this is all uh, based around taking off in um, prime conditions for carburetor ice that I didn't think could exist. Um, really uh, didn't think about it and uh, kind of had given some thought where it was so oh, it's clear and there's no chance and we got sunshine and all that fun stuff but you look at the temperature and the dew point spread and they are both spot on five degrees uh, celsius so it puts it at just absolutely prime conditions for carburetor rates at any power setting so um, lesson learned on this one short flight takeoff uh, talk to ATC, turn around, land at the airport. Thankfully, it was uh, VFR. So um, anyway, uh, take a look at the video. Let me know your comments and let's get into it. Flying IFR somewhat today up to Santa Rosa for a site inspection on a community college. Figure about an hour in route. We were IFR here, but it is lifting ground fog, not very thick. VFR here. Let's take a listen. Tracy Municipal Airport, automated weather observation 1636 Zulu. Wind, calm, visibility less than one quarter. Fog, sky condition, overcast at 200. Temperature well, 5 it's Celsius. Not really Dew point bad. 5 Celsius. Altimeter 3 0. inches of mercury. The sensor is, it is. Tracy. All right, so our departure procedure is runway 30, climbing right turn to 3000, to heading of 150. So we'll go ahead and dial in a 150 now on the Modesto VOR 264 radial. So We'll put the 264 radial, 264 at the bottom there. So we've got everything set, briefed. What we'll do is, um, after we do a quick run up, we'll get the Bluetooth activated and call up NorCal and uh, pick up our clearance. So we'll get our keyboard on here. Circuit breakers are in it good. Trim set for takeoff. Fuel on both. Temperatures are coming up good. So brakes are set, fuel is both, trim is set for takeoff, flight controls we did, mixture best power, primer is in and locked, up to 1700 RPM, good drop, good drop, well, power B, good. Amp meter charging. And we'll just go ahead and lean that out. Yes, this is N1191 uh, Mike at Tracy and ready to pick up our uh, IFR clearance up to uh, Santa Rosa today. Uh, we are ready now and departing 3 0. And could you give me the squawk code again for 901 Mike? 
Okay, 1191 Mike is cleared to Santa Rosa via runway heading. Uh, obstacle departure procedure, Modesto. Ah. Okay, runway 30, obstacle departure procedure, Modesto, Oki, then direct. Climb and maintain 6000, departure frequency 125.1, squat code 4547 for Niner One Mike. Niner One Mike, will do. Thanks, Mike. Okay, we've got that. We will hang up. Everything's set, mixture in, lights are all on, and we've got it set so that we are going to go to a 150 heading after departure. Trace traffic, Skyhawk 91 Mike is taking 30, doing the uh, departure procedure to a uh, right turn of 150. Tracy traffic. Speed remaining. Everything's set. Here we go. Good morning, NorCal, Skyhawk, 4230, came back to 5,500 level. I remember 4230, Quebec, NorCal, Pro, Steve Stockton, 4328. 2830, Quebec. North Cal Approach, Skyhawk 901 Mike, we are off at of Tracy. We've got engine trouble returning to the airport. November 901 Mike, North Cal Approach, right there, you do clear an emergency. I think we could make the uh, runway. We were uh, somewhat VFR when we lifted off and we're direct to the airport now. November 91, Mike, or Roger. And uh, are you still IFR or VFR? Uh, I can see the airport. We're VFR. 91, Mike, Roger, just verify you're canceling IFR. Uh, we'll cancel IFR, airport in sight for 91, Mike. November 91, Mike, Roger. And just uh, call the phone number once you're safely back on the ground, please. 91, Mike, Roger. 91, Mike, change to advisor for safety approved.
was freaking interesting. Gonna have to go do a really uh, solid run up and see what the frick is going on. Three Strathaic Skyhawk 901 Mike is clear 30 taxiing back to South Hangers. Yes, uh, November 1191 Mike is safely back on the ground in Tracy. Um, go ahead and take it out of the system for now. I've got to um, do some additional run-ups and things to see what the problem was. All right, thanks. Take care. Yes. Yes. Um, I had some engine roughness and sputtering um, on takeoff up at about 700 feet, and um, ended up just deciding to uh, come back to the airport. All right. All right thanks. Skyhawk 9 or Mike's crossing over 3012 South Hangers. Well, that could have been real interesting if it was all sucked in. You know, I don't think it was carb ice, but could have been carb ice. Temperature well, 5 it's Celsius. Not really Dew point that. 5 Celsius. So here's a chart that I downloaded from the internet. That is um, the carburetor icing probability chart. And if you look at where we had the dot at uh, 5 degrees Celsius and uh, 5 degrees dew point, it is right smack dab in the middle of the dark, which is severe icing, any power. So lesson learned, and I won't do that again. Come back to this again. Shall do.